How much money are you spending on supplements for your gut health? What would you rather be spending that money on? You could buy a new phone, go out to eat. For a lot of people, it's like a car payment. For me, I was getting a probiotic, you know, once or twice a month. So that's like $50 a bottle, you know, to buy a good one. Some of them are even more. I had a vitamin D and K2 supplement. I had a fish oil supplement. That was 50 bucks a month. I had organ capsules. That was another 50 bucks a month. I had enzymes, that was another 50 bucks a month. I was always trying some random herb, that's another 50 bucks. Maybe I would hear about acupuncture or red light therapy. There's another $200 down the drain. You know, it'd be one thing if it worked. All my friends and family weren't having to do all this, jumping through all these holistic hoops and they were in much better health than I was. And it just really frustrated me to see them spend their money on fun things while well, I had to spend it on these supplements that weren't really helping. But that all changed for me when I actually started addressing the root cause of the problem, which is a traumatic event putting your gut into overdrive and being haunted by it on a subconscious level. The way that I help people fix that is with my 13-day protocol. I made this with a hypnotist and NLP expert to free your mind of that traumatic event so it stops putting your gut in and out of overdrive. I tried all different types of herbs to help you relax and it still wasn't working. Like imagine taking things that help you relax and you have a car coming at you 50 miles per hour. You're not gonna relax. You have to address that car screaming at you that's putting your gut in and out of overdrive. It's costing you thousands of dollars a month that you could be spending on a new car or other fun things.